Now, I know you might be thinking the Cincinnati Zoo is most famous for rhinos or tigers or gorillas, but we are also famous for our pados. This is Gabriel. He's an adult African pado. He lives in the nocturnal house, therefore he's nocturnal. You can tell by those great big eyes. But you might not know that pados are primates like us. They have fingernails, grasping hands, binocular vision. They're related to more famous prosimians like the lemurs of Madagascar. But these guys spend their lives up in trees. He's very good at grasping with his hands. He'd spend his days resting in the trees and his night out foraging for food. Now what's interesting is he moves very slowly on purpose. It's a thing called cryptic locomotion that helps him not only keep from being eaten, but it allows him to sneak up on things he might eat because these guys like us are omnivores. So they'll eat some plants, but if they can catch them, they'll eat some animals too. So while he moves in slowly when it's time to grab, he will grab fast and hard. I know because I've been bitten by a pato and it's more than you might imagine from an animal this size. But Gabriel won't bite me. He's a good guy. Here at the Nocturnal House at the Cincinnati Zoo, I'm Thane Maynard with Gabriel the Pato.